Yo, what up guys? It's your boy Frenchy coming back to you guys with another video. Today, I'm going to teach you guys how to unlock your iPhone that has a passcode or any d Apple device that is disabled for a certain amount of times, years or whatever. I'm going to teach you guys right now on how to do it. Let's get right into it. My iPhone right here. Can unlock it and everything. Let's get right into it. So first, we're going to need to enter the passcode in whatever. Just, I'm going to show you guys just for the purposes. I'm going to enter the passcode in too many times. That's cur that's wrong. Uh, let's see how long this takes. Okay. As you guys can see, iPhone is disabled. Try again in one minute. Can't log in or anything, as you guys can see. Whatever cord your phone takes, that's what you will need. We'll try this again in one minute, but just for now, let's just plug it in. Perfect. <clears throat> As you guys can see, my stuff will pop up right over here. Enter passcode. Let's try it one more time. iPhone is disabled. Try again in five minutes. This is what you've been waiting for. So actually, wait, before you guys plug that in, you don't need to plug it in, just reset it. What I'm going to do right now, hold down the home and power button. Once that is done, you're going to hold the home button for a couple of seconds and then plug in the charger. As you guys can see, it turns back on and then it says connect to iTunes. What you're then going to want to do is go to iTunes and then you'll get to this message there's a problem with the iPhone that requires it to be updated or restarted if you guys don't want to update your device click restore and then actually are you sure you want to restore the iPhone to factory settings all your media data will be erased and the newest version of the phone and software will be installed what you guys are going to want to do is click restore and update you're going to want to give it a few seconds, let it do its thing, come back when it's actually done. Alright guys, iTunes is finished with everything that it's doing. Um, for some reason it got an unknown error, so let's see if it turns on. Alright, so guys, here the iPhone is turning on. Everything is finally complete. So this will reset your iPhone and update it. Um, the steps is, it takes about a couple minutes. You know, it depends on your computer and it depends on iTunes personally to see how fast it'll go. Some computers are better than others. You know, sometimes your internet, I feel like, has a play in it. So here we go. Let's see how it looks. See if it actually reset it. Wow, look at that. Complete updated phone. Um, as you guys can see, it reset the whole phone. Wow, look at that. Beautiful. All right, guys, there you go. That is how you restore your phone completely. Um, it removed everything that I have completely. So the cool thing about this is you could get into any phone that isn't locked to iCloud. So... What you're going to want to do, like I said, have a computer, have your iTunes, have your cord, have everything ready. Restart your phone by holding the power and the home button. Then, once you do that, turn uh, on your phone by holding the home button and plugging it in. Just for a few seconds, five seconds minimum. Then, what you're going to want to do is, when it pops up the button, it'll say update your phone restore there has been an error to fix the problem restart your phone once you do that you wait give it some time and then you're pretty much good to go and then it'll take a couple of minutes and then your phone will be completely started from from fresh so that's the end of the video if you guys are new to the channel subscribe if you like the content we upload once a week and make sure you turn on the notification roll the outro